Hi guys, it's Michelle. Welcome to my channel, Grateful Creations. So glad you're here. Well, I'm gonna do obviously a pearl pour onto a failed pour. I would show you guys all my failed pours, but that would take too long. So in any case, I'm gonna be doing a primary color palette, but Ella Michelle. So this is golden iridescent bright gold mixed with some Modern Master Champagne. This is Thalo Blue from Lucas Krell, and I mixed it with some black to make a, a blue black out of this. The black is, this is Golden Magenta mixed with Modern Master Sachet Red. And I put a little tiny squirt of the Ultramarine Blue in here, just a little bit. And those are my colors. Oh, plus, of course, oh, there we go. <laughs> This is um, Modern Masters in Iridescent White. So I've mixed up my base coat and this base coat happens to be the old recipe with the 2019. And this is a 12 by 16 canvas. I've actually got a dump bucket here so I can save some of this. I hope it's big enough. So I'm going to roll it off and roll it off. And it's not quite big enough, <laughs> almost. And bring it down. Yeah, I've still got some coming down here. It never goes to waste, guys. Don't worry about it. It looks like I need more on the canvas. I have my hands off handles on here. Oops, still not I'm missing a couple spots. There we go. My nieces are making pizza rolls with cre um, crescent rolls. Something their Aunt Michelle taught him to do quite a while ago. Yeah, I might have to put some more paint down. Yep, 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 yep. Just a little bit. This is fresh new paint that I just mixed up. So there might be some bubbles in it, but we'll take care of those. And I painted my edges. with just some white paint. It doesn't have to be um, Artist Loft Flow or you can use any white paint. I'm just trying to use up some of the stuff that I, the, the awful stuff. All right, I got some in there. Oh, there was still more coming down. Yep. I'm trying to make it a nice even coat. Oh my goodness, I missed my sides here completely. <clears throat> All right, so it's going to be kind of like a primary color type of pour. And this this side. I'm trying to get all of my sides covered. I'm going to bring it back down this way. So we get pearls everywhere. Now I'm gonna try, <laughs> I know you guys, I'm gonna try to do this minimalist. Yeah, we'll see how that goes. And I wanted to let you grow up, I wanted to let you guys know that I'm going to be doing a collaboration with a very talented artist. She's kind of new to YouTube, but oh my gosh, her work is absolutely fabulous. 
Stay tuned for that. We're gonna be doing a split cup. She's the one who had the recipe for the permanent violet dark. So that's gonna be one of the colors we're gonna be using, but our, our mixed up one. So let me start. is the iridescent, here's the gold, here's the magenta slash sachet. Let's start over here. What are trucks doing out this late at night? <laughs> and here's the blue black, blue black that I created. I am going to bring it down this way and then that way. Tilting off quite a bit of paint. And I'm going to turn it around and bring it back this way. Really quick, hopefully. Because I see some curls happening already. Oh, I like what I'm seeing. Sorry, you guys can't see it too well. I'm sorry. Sorry about that. I've got some wonky cells I'm going to try and straighten out when I move it back. And I really like simple. Simple as best. And the primary colors, although they're gold. My yellow is gold. Let me see if I can bring these back and get them to cooperate. I don't think so. Well, we're just gonna let it go and see what happens. Let me see if you're straight. I'm gonna put you on time lapse. Might go have a pizza roll <laughs> and come back and play with this because I really like this, but it's like they are kind of wonky, but I might be playing with it. So you're on time lapse now.
Hey guys, so I did something a little different tonight. I don't know if you noticed, but that other pour had some wonky looking cells in it. So I just poured right over it. I didn't scrape it. I just poured right over it and I really like the results. So I guess there's a new technique over out now. Pour over pour. Kind of like it. We'll have to see what it looks like in the morning. You know, some of these colors are coming through. I love that cell right there. Oh my goodness. And uh, yeah, there's a lot of shadows, shadow colors that are coming through. I love those. And uh, that's actually, there's some ore in this. Ore and golden. Oh yeah, you can tell it's ore. Spock or Spock. I put ore in everything. <clears throat> kind of like that hot sauce lady. Anyhow, um, I'll have to see what this looks like in the morning. But I'm really happy with it right now. All of the, this is three colors, three colors. And it created all of these different colors. Very happy with that. Yep. Yep, yep, yep. Yep, there's some more. It's got the pinks and purples and blues and greens and yellows. That's special right there. It looks like an opal. Very cool. All right, guys, I'm going to let you go for now. Um, please be safe and create. Please like, share, and subscribe. And do remember... All of my artwork is available for sale. You can reach me privately at gcfluidart at gmail.com. Oh, ciao for now.